Keep up the good work, true brothers and sisters. Keep the faith of Jesus Christ and God and the obedience of righteousness and holiness commandments. The world does not will not receive, are not worthy of the calling. They will not receive us. They will not see Jesus Christ. It's in the Bible, the real Jesus and God. It's truth. They will not receive the love of truth, but believe on and be damned. And we're living in the end times as it's being fulfilled since 15, 1600 years. The false gospel, of course, the rest of the world was wicked. Now, the rest of the world, what we're seeing on, we're living in Song of Gomorrah and the days of Noah. People, 99.99% more people, are chilling the devil, including the false churches. They are not saved, but deceived. And they all love it all. They love their pastors, which is only one pastor, Jesus Christ. Not themselves, they have made themselves God in the temple of their own gods, not a physical temple, and he'll be built in Jerusalem. That's all done away with it through Jesus Christ in the temple, the spiritual temple in us. Oh, the sinners, they got their unclean temple. And the fall, man, all that is when they, when Jesus came, destroyed all the goats and sheep, start teaching the old Torah. We live for God and Jesus, and a preacher of Jesus Christ and God, and a true, for true brothers and sisters. That we are in the last times, the wicked days, and end times, like in the book of Revelations and other far anyways, and um, scriptures talking about that we obey and follow Jesus. We have to do and come out from among them, be separated, be a pure, pure bride. Jesus has come for a pure, godly, righteous, holy bride, like in the five wives virgins not the five foolish like the false churches are they're the five foolish and they're the five five wicked ones in the book of revelation it talks about the five the churches there's more than that but i'm just saying but there's only one true church they the called out ones ecclesia uh truth called out holy ghost who true church us and that's the ones that's the true god fearing people with the spirit of god the true ones not these false fantasy Apostasy, darkness of demons, whore, Satanists that live in sin and filth, and their church trash, their whole Babylon system, the world, how Babylon said that they all love walling. They're liars, and there's no truth in them, and they're not going to heaven, they're on their way to hell, and you can't rightly judge them. They don't want to be rightly judged because they're children of the devil, and they're all wicked sinners, or liars. And they wall in their sins, and with their false Jesus and God, and their false sin not stuff, and all this. You want to see, you know, Seeing some more, judge not, judge not. Listen, they and all that lies that they can twist scripture because they don't want you unrighteously judge them. They know they're guilty before God, but they're already damned. The book of Revelations already has condemned them. God has already spoken as it is written. They already condemned. They walk out of flesh, not the spirit, and they're liars. And they will not come out and follow Jesus anyways. And the world will come out of the world. And the father really just God to come out from among the wickedness and all the rest. They love their false gods, pagans, holidays, and all the rest. The true brothers and sisters in Christ, look up for the heavens, for Jesus will come back for us. Either when you die, just wait for Jesus, just come back and you die, he'll call you up, or when we're still alive. Amen.